today I will be going for the Platinum Trophy in one of the most controversial games of all time. SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom. As you have probably heard, this game is filled with inappropriate and crude moments. And it's even... <clears throat> oh, wait, hold on. My producer's telling me it's actually bully. So yes, another controversial Rockstar game. What a surprise. But Bully has something that not even GTA has. Child violence. It was even banned in Brazil over the fear that it encouraged bad behavior. For example, you can bully other students in various ways, such as pushing them into garbage cans, giving them wedgies, or even shoving them into lockers. So it's safe to say the concern is pretty understandable. <laughs> I got my first trophy in this game for finishing my third class. Then I got my first story trophy for beating this big boy Russell in a fight. How do I avoid that? Okay, what? Oh, I can kind of chip down his damage. Oh, what the? Oh my gosh. Come on, get in there. Get in there. I'm missing. All right, I think I get it now. I just got to avoid these. Then you can run into the wall, and I can get an uppercut in, and then run away. I'll just keep doing that. Oh, do we finish him? Oh, let's go. In Chapter 2, I gain respect from the preppy click by, well, basically just by beating them all up. Which, that's a reoccurring theme in this game. In each chapter, I'll be gaining respect from a new click, and you basically do that by just claiming dominance over them. Do I have to beat you first? Okay, you're just gonna throw an egg at me? That's so annoying. All right, who's next? Who wants the smoke? Sophomore. We, oh, that was end of chapter two. Immediately after, we also got this trophy. And popularity contest, what is this one for? Gain 100% respect from two clicks simultaneous. Simu simultaneously. 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 And yeah, words are hard. I'll go with that. A few miscellaneous and story trophies later, I got my first combat trophy for knocking out 200 people. Finish. At the end of the last chapter, I had a fight against my arch nemesis, Gary, but he was really easy to beat. Come on, Gary, do something. Get out of my face. Oh. Oh, gosh, I thought we were about to fall through, like bunch of floors Are you, i mean like i thought you were gonna be difficult you'd have such a big talk and then you don't can't really do anything about it roundhouse to the face and he's on the ground is that it <laughs> graduate i guess it is complete chapter five with the main story complete i began by getting some of the easier miscellaneous trophies such as giving 50 wedgies aching 25 cars and getting 25 kisses. Which, oh yeah, let's talk about this. There's some romanceable characters in this game, which feels really wrong since you're playing as children. I mean, there's even hand-holding in this game. FBI, open up! The next trophy I got was for finishing my last class. And for this class, I had to go to the carnival and take pictures of people at the freak show. Once I returned to class, the trophy popped. As I was working on some miscellaneous trophies, I got this trophy for running 100,000 meters on foot. For this next trophy, I needed to mow the lawn 10 times, and this was very oddly fun to me. I just found it satisfying. So who knows, maybe I'll go for the lawn mowing simulator platinum someday. These next two trophies I got are in relation to bikes. And this should be our last bike we need, Jack. Thanks for lending me your bike. Come yeah, on, let's Jimmy. do some wheelies now too. Because we can get oh or the first wheelie we do we're gonna get it the wheel deal perform 200 wheelies on a bike for this next trophy i needed to buy 100 sodas and let's just say at this point i had bought less than 10 sodas so this took a while 20 minutes later uh, then there are the go-kart races and there's two separate trophies for these the first one i got was for beating all five go-kart races at the fair Okay, I'm just stuck in the back right now. This is annoying. So four laps for this. I need a good turn right here. No, if I didn't hit that guy, I would have been... That would have been perfect. Oh my gosh, I hit him again. He's just all up in my way. Oh my gosh, he's hitting me. Hey. Oh. oh I just need to get out in front. Once I'm out in front, we're fine. Honestly. Oh, this is good. What? We're stuck. What the heck? 
Is that the same dude? It is. I hate that guy. Now he's pushing me. He's boxing me out to this. Okay, who are you? And why, what do you have against me? Oh my gosh, we're so far. What is your beef with me? Right, I'm in first, barely. Oh no, bad turn. Going first. This guy's now behind me. My arch nemesis right here. Okay, this is the turn I always mess up on. All right, not bad. That was good. I think it's smooth sailing kind of from here on out. Is this the end right here? Yes. Okay. The second go-kart trophy came after beating all three street races. So far, these street ones have been easier in the sense that the people I'm up against seem to be doing worse, but also the the race is harder itself. Like, there's a lot more tight turns and quick turns. Can I just cut through this whole thing? I don't know if that's smart, because then I just ram into the wall like that. No! Oh! Where am I going? No! Oh, no! All right. Somehow, I'm not, like, even that far behind. Focus up. I think this is the end right here. We get a good turn here, we win. The name's oh, I, won I didn't realize the ending was right there, but we won. <laughs> that was kind of close. For this next trophy, I needed to get the high score in three different arcade games. These arcade games are found at different points around the map. The last arcade game I had to beat was actually kind of difficult. But I need to get a score of 69,900, so this might take a little bit. And also, I only have two lives already, so... Okay, I have one life already. So, we're gonna have to probably restart this. <laughs> I wonder if a bat... Wait, what? That hit me? Oh! No! Oh, I only have one life now. Right, this is definitely the kind of start we needed. We're already at 30,000, and we still have three lives left. Oh, no! Okay, we lost our first... Oh... Okay, we lost our first life. Oh, this is getting real close. What? That took a life? Oh my gosh, we only have one life now. Are you serious? I was like, not, I was not expecting this mini game to be this intense. <laughs> oh my gosh. 3,000 more. 2,000. Don't get hit, please. I would actually probably cry. Come on. One more thing? We gotta defeat one more thing, right? We got it, right? Yeah, okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna end the game. We got it. All right, there we go. For this next trophy, I had to destroy 300 bottles in this fair game. And to get up to 300 bottles, I needed to replay it 16 times. Really good start. Ooh, nice little flick to there. Oh, we're kind of popping off with the bottles right now. Ooh. Oh, we even got the sheriff badge. Uh, oh, we got it. Okay. Glass dismissed. This next trophy is the trophy with the most parts to it. For it, you need to collect all 36 room trophies. And you get these room trophies for completing missions and different types of tasks. So you really start working towards this trophy right away. And the last room trophy I needed was the tombstone one, which I got by destroying all the tombstones. All right, here's the last four. And last one, there we go. Secret unlocked, the mask. Now let's return to our dorm room. This is the trophy I'm most excited to get finally unlocked because it's probably the biggest grind. Yeah, because Ford, I had to complete all the missions and get all the collectibles and do some other various tasks. But finally completing this is awesome. These next two trophies had to do with distance traveled. For this first one, I needed to travel 100,000 meters on a bike. And then for the next one, I needed to travel 50,000 meters on a skateboard. But while I was just riding around on the skateboard, I got a little distracted. Well, now this isn't nearly enough speed. <laughs> yeah! Oh, okay. We'll classify that as a grind. Oh, wait. That actually was a grind. That was sick. Hold on. We can make a little edit here. All right. I think we got a decent speed going here. All right. Oh, what did I just hit? Oh! There we go, Skate Pro. And at last, we had just one trophy left. So for this last trophy, we have to accumulate 160,000 trouble points. And right now we're at 108,000. 
So basically, we just kind of wreak havoc around the town and attack a lot of adults, do a lot of violence. Two hours later. This has definitely been the worst trophy to go for. I've just been sitting up in this tree for, honestly, it might be a couple hours now. And I've just been shooting adults to try to get some points. And uh, not a fun journey. But we're almost there. And I'm not really sure if I get more points for letting the yellow bar go down to yellow or... There we go, problem child. We finally got it, okay. Oh, wow. All right, we're, wow. I spent a couple hours just sitting in that tree shooting adults, so that was not fun. But there we go, finally amassed 160,000 trouble points. Let's go. You know what that means, that was our last trophy, so? We got the platinum now, there we go, baby. Valedict valedictorian. Before this video, I had never played this game before, so I ended up taking my time and enjoying it. But in the end, it took me about 22 hours to complete. And I gotta give Rockstar kudos, they made another banger with this game.